lecture 9. The diagram below shows how water and food are transported to parts A, B, C and D of a plant. The question is, which parts of the plant do A, B, C and D represent? So, in the middle here, we have the stem. Okay, this broken arrow is representing food, while the solid arrow is representing water. So, if we look at A, this is where water is coming from and given to the stem, which is then given to other parts of the plant. So since this is the start of where the water is coming from, it must be the roots. So A should be the roots. As for C, we can see that food is coming from C, given to the stem, and then transported to other parts of the plant. So food originates from leaves. So C is the leaves. B and D can be any other parts of the plant, apart from the roots, leaves and stem. So let's check out the options given. For A, it must be roots. So the only options left are 2 and 4. We can cancel out option 1 and option 3. So A is roots given by option 2 and 4. And C is leaves. Let us check C. Okay, only option 4 will stand now as leaves is indicated in option 4. So option 2 is out. So B and D is flower and fruit, which is other parts of the plant receiving the water and the food. So answer is option 4.